Number Western one. Kentucky has been waiting all week for this one. Get ready, folks. The opening kickoff is finally here. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Rockets and their coaching staff are just happy to have a guy like this in the program. They're he's playing with. Well, I think it gives them the diversity that they're looking for. I mean, at times they're going to run the football. Other times they're going to try to air it out. And when you have one guy that gets so much attention on the outside, it just seems to open up other aspects of their offensive attack. And they've done a good job as an offensive staff of putting together a good plan. And I'm sure we're going to see it again today. A part of any quarterback's arsenal should be the ability to sell the run with a good fake. He does a really good job here on the fake, and then they pick up some nice yards. He's into the open beam. He makes his way to about the 48. Gain of 11 yards. First down. that sixth sense of when to get out of there and avoid the pressure or just to throw the ball before you get hit. And down with the reception. Number one brings him down at the 38-yard line. That makes it first and ten. He's taken down right around the 42-yard line. The defense was just all it didn't fool anybody. From the 42 yard line, second down. Fires it again. He tackles the 38 that play. That's a good pickup there. He just dropped back and delivered a nice throw. and it's incomplete. He tried to hit his receiver in stride, but overthrew it a little too much. That'll come in time. Just repetition, throwing that same pass over and over, and he'll be fine. Toledo could take the lead with this field goal. Kicks up, and he splits the uprights. Kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. Goes into the end zone, down for a The quarterback leads the team out on the field for the first drive. He's going to try and scramble, and he's tackled right around the 20 yard line. So the quarterback scrambles for out of yard. Let's go. What are you From their own 26 yard line, second down. Fires out to his receiver. Here's an opening. They'll bring him down to 34. Empty backfield. Back five wide. Fires that brought down at the front. Great effort here by the wideout to get the ball and get some extra yardage. First and ten. Ball on their own 43. Field. That's a team that makes it they need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. They go with the runner. He's taken down behind the line. That brings 
us a fourth and seven. He puts it away, and it's a great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. We're about set to start things up again. Toledo has a three-point lead. A two-yard run by the halfback. That's a team of two. That makes it second and eight. made around the 38-yard line. And a nice pick up there. I'll tell you what, the defense gambled a bit here and came with the blitz, and a quarterback showed tremendous poise by making a good read and delivered a nice ball to the open man. Blue 14! Blue 14! Motion, motion, motion! Hey. Out of bounds around the 42-yard line. We'll call it a gain of four yards. Four down, four down. That makes it second and six. He's on the run. He's at midfield. Gets out to around the 45. That's good for a gain of 13 yards. First down. He tackles him for a loss. That'll bring up second and 11. He makes it to the 42-yard line. The back hits three on the carry. That's the senior safety that made that tackle. Great job of providing run support from the secondary. Third down, and they need to get it down to the 35. I got one, I got one. Mike four, Mike They'll spread four. the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. Got his man. Can't tack on any yardage. So close, but they fall short of the first down. You've got to throw the ball a little deeper next time. Don't take any chances of coming up short. You don't need three guesses to figure out what they're going to run right here on fourth and short. He gets out to about the 35-yard line. Well, they decided to go for it, but the defense slammed the door on him. That's the definition of coming through when it matters most. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. And he's level at the 32. Boy, this defense is doing a great job of bringing pressure. That time they brought a blitz and allowed the defensive line to break loose and get to the quarterback. Defense looking for another sack here on this second and 13 situation. Gains his way to the 40-yard line. He scrambled. That's a great tackle at the 48-yard line. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 48. Long ways yet to go, but at the end of one, Toledo's got a three-point lead. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. Five wide. They make the stop at the 43-yard line. It's second down now. They're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Brought down after a nice run up the middle.
Quick pass. Four yards on that play. Tight end does a good job here of selling his block and then getting out on his route and making a nice catch for a good game. From the 35-yard line, second down. the 27. This is the eighth play of this drive. Now he's scrambling. They bring the quarterback down. The protection broke down. The defense was in the backfield in a hurry, and they brought the quarterback down. Nice play. Second and 14. And this is the ninth play of the current drive. Ready! Green 19! Hot! Green 19! Hot! He's got it with room to run. Steps out of bounds at the 28 yard line. And so it's another third down upcoming here. Around the 19 yard line. That's good for the game. That'll make it fourth and two. Western Kentucky is down three and looking to tie it up. He gets it up and it splits the uprights. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all this one great kick and they can forget about returning this one this is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime pulls down the catch and he's got room here First down. down. Three down, three down. I got two, got two, got two. Got two. Hey, check, 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 check. Oklahoma. Motion, 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 motion. Motion, motion. Hand off, and he's met in the backfield. That brings up second and two. From their own 35 yard line, it's second down. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. And he tackles him hard at the 39. That's a Looks to his back, and he's got him again. He's taken down right around the 48-yard line. Gets it away. Wait a minute, he's going to throw. They'll bring him down at midfield. From the 50. First down. Three down, three down. Mike four, Mike four. Black five, black five. Green nine. Go. Somebody jumped early down there. False start, start offense. offense. Sometimes what happens on a false start is a lineman will see Still movement on the down. other side of the ball and be coaxed into jumping early. So the penalty will make it first and 15. Just throws this one away. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. And he's 
tackled right away. With the reception. Gain of 17 yards. That makes it first and 10. Mike four. Set. Cut. He wants it all. Got a man open. Touchdown. Splits the uprights with the extra point. So an eight-play, 81-yard drive, and they get it in for seven. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. So our score, 10-3. With one quarter down, I really haven't seen too much separation between these two squads. Might be neck and neck the whole way. Scrambling around. He's tackled in the open field. He must not have seen anybody open on that play. Nobody opened downfield, but he's got to be careful. I like his toughness, but those kind of hits are going to take a toll on him eventually. And he is drilled at the 44-yard line. From their own 44-yard line, it's first down. He's scrambling, and he hits him hard at the 39-yard line. Wow, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman. When the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday. Now. And he's going to be sacked. That makes four sacks today. Well, this speed is difficult to defend because you have to try to keep them off balance so they can't use their quickness. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 46. They come out in a five-wide set. Let's go! He's at midfield, and he's hit before he can go anywhere. That's a game of 13. That brings us fourth and three. It's away, and it's a booming punt. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. We've reached halftime, and we couldn't have asked for a better first half. 10-3, Toledo. Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. He just drills this one. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. The cavalry's coming. He's tackled at the 30. Picks up five on the scramble. From their own 30-yard line, it's second down. He's hit and taken down. right around the 42-yard line. This is smart, efficient play calling. You don't need to make the highlight reel on each play. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. 34 is the mic. 34 is the mic. He's coming. Check him. Check him. Here we go. Throws it in a hurry. They'll bring him down at the 47-yard line. A nice-looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. Ready. 
Catches it, and he's looking for more. Brought down right around the 38-yard line. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. On play action. Quarterback's going to run it, and he's got room to work. And he's taken down at the 14-yard line. They move the sticks after another first down. Impressive drive by this offense so far. I really like what they're doing by keeping this defense on their heels and moving the ball downfield. From the 14-yard line, first down. Big play, and it's first and goal. And this is the eighth play of the drive. They're trying to stop the run here with a goal line defense. And the end zone touchdown. Here comes the kicker to try to tie this game up. And he hits the PAT. An eight-play, 76-yard drive, and a touchdown as a result. You know, Brad, a lot of times you have to watch practice and watch a seven-on-seven -seven drill to not see the ball touch the ground. This time, they went the entire length of the field. The ball never touched the ground. Great execution by the quarterback and the receiver. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Time's getting a little bit tighter now. You got to make every possession count. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. Number 13 on the tackle at the 31 yard line. That'll make it second and four. Play action. Slings it out and it gets tipped. Hey, that's a heads up play there by the defender. Get those hands up and something good may just happen. They're about four yards away here on third down. Mike four, Mike four. <laughs> Tackle made around the 39 yard line. Game is eight on the play. First down. First down. Four down, four down. Mike four. Nice run up the middle. Makes the tackle. five yards. That brings him second and five. They bring him down in the backfield. You know, sometimes the defense just has a beat on an option, and there's no way the offense can gain positive yards on. It. So we're looking at another third down here. They make the stop at the 32-yard line. They'll spread the field with five wide. And he's immediately tackled. That'll make it second and inches. Makes it out to maybe the 19-yard line. That's a game of three on the play. That makes it first and ten. Mike, four. Come on. Hey, And he stopped behind the line. That makes it second and fourteen. From the 23-yard line. Second down. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Deep pass to the end zone. Touchdown, Rockets. And 
and he adds the extra point. So a 10 play, 77 yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown drive. The score now, 17 10. Kirk, if this keeps going like it has been, we are going to have one exciting fourth quarter. I just hope we continue to see this kind of execution. It's a lot of fun to be able to watch these offenses make plays, and it kind of has that feel. Whoever does have the ball last and a chance to make a play could win this game. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. Strike to his receiver, no good. It's second and 10. Ball on the 25 yard line. 41. Got the corner. Good solid running right there. Getting past the defensive lineman and into the secondary before he could be stopped. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 44. He scrambles. Tackle around the 41 yard line. Call it a game of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. Man left, man left. Go down, go down. Mike 34, Mike 34. Ready! Green night! He makes his way to about the 32. We've got a first and ten. Ball on the 32 yard line. So it's complete, but they didn't get much there. And that's because the defense was just waiting on it, and they attacked. The quarterback should have found somebody else downfield. So at the end of three, Toledo leads it 17-10. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Hands off left, and they got him behind the line. Loss of two on the play. This is the eighth play of this drive. He's out of bounds, right around the 28-yard line. And it's the offense that takes the field on fourth down. Now he's scrambling. And down he goes at the nine. So here we go, first and goal, and a field goal won't cut it. Touchdown, Hilltopper. Boy, he looked 
determined running the football. Nobody was going to keep him out of the end zone. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. He makes the PAT. A 10-play, 75-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. You know, this offensive line has done a really good job, but really, I think it's more about the big play ability from the running backs and why we've seen so many big plays from this offense. This game is all tied up, 17. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This is my kind of game. We have a chance to see so many touchdowns. I just wonder if this offense can continue the flow that we've seen from the previous three series. We might have overtime in the back of our minds, but down on the field, that hasn't occurred to anyone. They want to end this thing in regulation. There's a strike complete. He's taken down at the 29. They get four yards on that pass play. You don't have to throw it deep to have success. Any sort of completion can help boost an offense's confidence. Got some open field. That makes it first and ten. And it's caught, and he's brought down quickly. Number four brings him down at the 47-yard line. That will make it second and four. Out of bounds at about the 49. That's a game of four. That'll bring up third and inches. He's tackled at the 41 yard line. Game of eight yards. First down. tries to buy some time he's at the 30 he gets hit out of bounds at the 26 yard line you know that saying get your keys out because we're on a drive this offense right now is on a drive I mean it, this is their third first down they're doing just about anything they want and they're really starting to wear the psyche of this defense down watch two, watch two. from the 26 yard line first down gets out to about the 25-yard line. Just under three to go in regulation. He gets rid of this one. Third down, and they need to get it to the 15. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Caught with room to work. And he's tackled at the 17 yard line. Number 94 makes the set at the 17 yard line. Alright guys, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. He gets it up, and the field goal is good. And so they take the lead with that field goal. Big time kick late in the game. That was a clutch kick to put them up on top. Toledo kicked this one off. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And they can forget about returning this one. The Hilltoppers were really mistaken if they looked at this game as a gimme. Well, they've been in a dogfight the entire ball game. Let's see what they can do with this final drive. They still have time here to be able to pull out and try to get a win. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. He's on the run. Runs with it, and he's got room. Well, they didn't pick up the first down, but he saw that no one was open, so he made the right decision to tuck it and run. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. Hey, check Mike 34. Mike 34. Hazat, green 90. He's scrambling. They'll bring him down at the 49. An empty backfield with five wide receivers. 
scrambling around. He's at the 40. Brought down at about the 35. First and 10, ball on the 35. Just under two minutes in the game. Boy, was he drilled as he let go of that football. Yeah, he's going to feel that one tomorrow. That makes it second and 10. He's going to try and scramble. And he is drilled at the 27 yard line. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. Just a huge stop right there here late in the fourth quarter in a game this tight. That might be one we look back on later and say that won the ball game. It's up, and he nails the long field goal. Western Kentucky is lining up to kick this one off. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The finish line's in sight. Let's see who wants this one more. you got to hurry here, but you don't want to rush things and make a critical mistake. This is what it all comes down to, right? This is why we love this game. Texas! He scrambled. And he's taken down at the 25-yard line. Under a minute left in the game. Scrambling. Tackle made around the 38 yard line. Toledo's going to take their first time out of the half. First and 10. Ball on the 38 yard line. Oklahoma, Oklahoma. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. Well, that's a big gain there for the offense, and all that's doing is giving this quarterback more and more confidence. They'll have one more chance for the end zone. Throws it deep. He goes up. Picked off. And that's the end of the fourth quarter, and we're going to take this deadlock into overtime. And we're back ready now for overtime. He fights forward to about the 23. Second down, eight yards to go. Ball on the 23. Gets it out quickly. And they make the stop at the 11. Number 26 brings him down at the 11 yard line. First down.
Gets it out complete again to his tight end. And he hits him hard at the four-yard line. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. That'll bring up second and three. And they got him. I think the quarterback here, even though he came up with a sack and he's on his back, he's also guilty here of not getting a better pre-snap read. You know, a lot of quarterbacks would get caught up in their size and their arm strength and how they throw the football. But the really good quarterbacks bring the intangibles to the table, and that means recognizing a blitz and affecting the offensive line and making the right call to adjust the protection. That time, he didn't do that. From the 11-yard line, third down. Quick pass, and he's tackled right away. That's good for the game, seven yards. That brings us fourth and three. Kicks away, and it's puts the uprights. From the 25 yard line, it's first down. Setting up blockers, the running backs got it on the screen. Loss of three. Pretty good stand there. They weren't fooled at all by the offensive play call. That brings up second and 13. Fights forward to about the 26. That's a gain of two on the play. That makes it third, and third down, and they need to get it to the 15. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. And that's his receiver who's wide open. That's a great tackle at the 11-yard line. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He's coming. Check him. Check him. Two tights. Two tights. Watch. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Call a loss of one yard. That'll bring up third and four. are secure in the knowledge that despite this setback today, they still have one of the best players in the country. Well, this is a devastating loss, but it's one that they're going to have to put behind them. And as you said, they still have one of the best players in the country. They don't need to deviate their plan, get back to really what they know, and that's getting the ball to their star player. And next week, I'm sure they'll be fine. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long.